but it's not sturdy. When you take the bolster off and you're looking at the skin graft, it looks it looks dead. It's wet. It's pasty. It's not impressive looking. So you still have to be extremely gentle with it. That's one week. That's ten days. Then you get to two weeks. You get to three weeks. That skin graft is it's still there. It doesn't look like the rest of your skin, but it's covered up that area where you basically had exposed muscle. And now it's actually starting to get sturdy. More collagen has grown in, more blood supply has grown in. Um, if you were to bump it, it won't completely tear off. But you still got to give it time. You can start to use it. You can move around. Uh, but you can't put it in harm's way, which your, your uh, example of, you know, what would you do with a three-month-old baby? Would you give a three-month-old baby wine? Would you give a three, take, let a three-month-old do deadlifts? No, you wouldn't. You know, so you got to use common sense. These stem cells are not that different from a skin graft. I mean, anatomically, cellular-wise, genetically, they're way, way different. But the timeline and the concept is basically the same. When you get these stem cells, you can't go fucking about right away. you got to give them time to do their job. Um, take seed in the tissues that need them or wherever you put them. And if you're careful with them, you know, with time, you're going to do really well. You just, it's, everybody gets some benefit. Uh, almost everybody gets some benefit out of it. It just it's just a matter of how much and what are you going to do with that benefit once you get it. And if you're in a, if you're a person who is active before and all of a sudden you you can't move and you you're actually in fear for your life. Once you start to get some function back, you're probably pretty happy. And I would imagine you're going to put it to use. So. Yeah, I, I, I agree with that 100%. I, you know, I also find people that are more active and know their bodies better yeah. can kind of figure out better what's going on. Yeah.